Hi St Francis School, it's really good to be back with you. Well, on Thursday this week, it's something called Ascension Day. And I wonder if you can think what that may, might be about. What does ascend mean? Well, it means to go up, just as descend means to come down. So Ascension Day means that somebody's going up. And it's the church, so the answer is always Jesus. It's the day when Jesus went back up to heaven. So do you remember what happened at Easter? Let's just go back a moment. At Easter on Good Friday, Jesus died on the cross and he died so that all the bad and sad things in the world would die with him. That's why it's called good, right? And then on Easter day, you might remember that Jesus came back from the dead. He rose from the dead. And that's what we remember. It's a massive celebration for Christians because it means that Jesus is alive now. And Jesus was seen by loads of people after Easter, after he'd risen from the dead. He even had a barbecue with his friends, which I think is pretty cool. Anyway, 40 days after Easter, Jesus went back up to heaven to be with his father and I thought I'd give it a go. I thought it would see if we could act out the story. So it went a bit like this. He told his friends to wait for the Holy Spirit to come to give them special power and as he was speaking his friends watched as he suddenly started going up to heaven. I guess it was something like this. Well, it's a cloudy day today. Jesus went up into the clouds, so we had a lot further to ascend. But I don't like heights very much, so I'm only going to ascend this far today. Anyway, why did Jesus have to go? I mean, if Jesus was alive and in person today, wouldn't it be much easier? He could just come into the class and tell us all about himself. You wouldn't need me to do it. Well, the trouble is, if he was here in just one person, he could only be at one place in one time. But instead, he went back up to heaven and he carries our prayers. Kind of not in a bag, but sort of. You can imagine it that way. Jesus went back up to heaven so that he can carry our prayers to God for us. And he sent his Holy Spirit from heaven back down to us. And the Holy Spirit is like God's power that can be with every single one of us all of the time. We just have to ask. And the Holy Spirit is what helps us to know that God is with us all the time, that he loves us all the time and that we can have his peace all the time. Here's another picture that might help us. I've got some bubbles in my pocket. I like a few bubbles. Let me blow some so I can get the lid off. There we go. Well, those bubbles were going down a bit, weren't they? But on a windy day, they'd go up and then what would happen? They'd go out of our sight and they'd probably pop, wouldn't they? Well, what happens to the air inside the bubble when it pops? The air just comes and is all around us, but we can't see it. It's not stuck in one particular bubble. It's just all around us again. And it's a little bit like Jesus's love. It's not stuck in one body on earth. It's released so that it's all around us all of the time. And that's why Ascension Day is something that we celebrate because it means that we know Jesus is still alive. He's in heaven next to God, bringing our prayers to God for us. And he sent his Holy Spirit. I know we'll think a bit more about that uh, in a couple of weeks time. But when he sent his Holy Spirit, it meant that we can know he's always alive and always with us. So it's a really cool thing. Why don't we pray together? Dear God, thank you so much for Jesus. Thank you that you sent him to earth and that he came back from the dead and that he went back up to heaven, carrying our prayers with him so that you can hear us. And God, thank you so much uh, that you sent your Holy Spirit so that we can know Jesus's love with us all of the time and not just to be found in one person in one place. Please would you fill us with your Holy Spirit today. Help us to know your love and your presence with us. Amen. Thanks St Francis School. Have a great day and see you soon.